My name is Kerstin Struppert. I'm the product manager of multi-related products in Thermo Fisher Scientific. I'm driving this business out of Thermo Fisher Scientific in Bremen, Germany. Today I would like to invite you to give you a tour about our ASMS 2012 poster presented here in Vancouver on the performance characteristic of an AP moldy ion source applied to executive plus mass spectrometer. In this context, I would like to discuss and emphasize the detection of bovine insulin at mass to charge 5700, the in-source decay fragmentation of intact protein cytochrome C, and the measurement of a synthetic polymer 3000 PEC 3350. The AP moldy ion source applied in our experiments is coming from MassTech, Columbia, Maryland in the USA. The Executive Plus is launched here in Vancouver at the ASMS and it has a couple of new features, one of which is most important for the detection of singly charged ions produced by Moldy. That is the extended mass range up to mass to charge 6000. Here I show you a photograph of the MassTech Moldy, AP Moldy ion source coupled to an Executive Plus mass spectrometer. The schematics of the instrument, of the Executive Plus instrument, is shown here, and the AP Moldy ion source is coupled directly in front of a SRIG stacked ring ion guide. With regard to the extended mass range, I would like to show you the application to medium size peptides in the example of insulin, bovine insulin mass to charge 5734. You see the singly charged ion accompanied with a doubly and a triply charged ion of insulin. Also displayed here are the insets into the isotope patterns of the singly, doubly and triply charged ion. All of them show accurate mass in their monoisotopic masses and show that with high resolving power. Another application example is the application of intact proteins prepared with 1,5-diamino-naphthalene matrix, abbreviated 1,5-dan. As a gift of nature, this matrix provides sequence-specific, intrinsically occurring fragment ion types of both the C-terminal and the N-terminal side of the peptide or the protein. In this example for cytochrome C, this is intactly prepared onto the sa sample plate with this matrix and it falls apart upon the moldy desorption process into complete sequences for Z-type ions. No sequence amino acid is missing here. And the same is true for fragments deriving from the N-terminal side. As an inset shown here, shows you Z23, Z25, Z26, and all of the sequences are complete, elongated with the C-terminal ions. <laughs> Another application example is the analysis of Poly polymers, synthetic polymers like polyethylene glycol prepared with 1,5-dehydroxybenzoic acid and lithium TFA as an ADEC formation guidance is applicable and shown here. You see the distribution of the polymer from 1,000 to mass to charge 5,000 and it is driven into the channel for the lithium adduct ion formation mm -hmm. and the insets here show you clearly that one can easily now describe which ion we are talking about. This is a lithium ion with high resolution and accurate mass performance. To summarize the poster, you can conclude that for the first time, intact bovine insulin at 5700 is detected on an executive series mass spectrometer. Insource decay fragment ions of cytochrome C are detected with 1,5 Darn matrix and N and C terminal ions are observed up to mass to charge 5000. PEC 3350, a synthetic polymer distribution, is easily displayed 
An adduct formation is unambiguously elucidated with 2,5-DHB matrix and lithium TFA addition. So I would like to invite you to visit thermoscientific.com slash ASMS if you want to find out more on this poster or in other posters related to Executive Plus launched at ASMS 2012. Thanks.